today and I loved it I loved it I enjoyed it all right <laughs> but I'm here with the straight flow okay I have got something like somebody's in an open marriage look I'm just going drunk down to it because I be forgetting shit quick so I gotta go ahead and say what I gotta say and when I get it right well somebody's like in an open relationship right and they are interested in somebody that who not won't be even down with that type of shit. You feel what I'm saying? So this person got to play like they ain't got nobody, okay? All right. So they be taking off the wedding ring or whatever, play singles, fuck when this person see them like, you know what I'm saying? This person wouldn't know this person married, but it didn't matter anyway because this person got an open marriage, right? Okay? So this person's kind of hard to get at. You feel what I'm saying? So this person got to pull in all the stops. I mean, everything into this shit to pull this person, okay? They won't, right? All right, and during this deal with the open marriage, I guess they can't deal with them, but so much don't put feelings into it. Usually, the other person know about it, or they usually pulling people who don't really give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? Just get it in and get out of there. Get in and get out of there, okay? But this person who they was trying to like, you know, I'm trying, you know, trying to pursue, like they they know this person ain't that type of, you know, on that type of time or on that type of shit. So, they really like trying to pursue this person. You feel what I'm saying? So, either somebody don't know that they're dealing with a married person in open marriage. And I feel like that's not cool. But, anywho. But, yeah. Okay. And they be um, pursuing them. I feel like y'all been going out. They been coming to your house. You been cooking. They just been doing all the stuff. Just kind of feel like y'all in a whole relationship. But, really, this person in the open damn marriage. It would no go, go no farther than what y'all doing. Okay. Which I feel like that's not right because I feel like it's fucked up because the simple fact is not only you ain't being honest with this person letting them know like look I got open marriage I can go outside my marriage but it won't be no more than that I'm sticking with the person I'm with it's us you know what I'm saying we just do this from time to time and shit like that right but nah they ain't say shit like they ain't telling this person none of that okay so now this person catching feelings which I think is fucked up because like you in the whole open marriage and then you fucking with single person. First of all, if you already married, why are you out here in the single field anyway? Okay, that's just greedy. That's greedy to me. That's some selfish, greedy shit I ever seen in my life. Okay, anywho, then you get this person caught up in their damn feelings with something that can never happen, but you get them believing like it's gonna go far and you the right one. Somebody probably, and I'm kinda getting with somebody case though. I don't know why somebody's going to go through it like that open marriage is going to fuck up the marriage because this person really catching feelings for somebody and they rather end the marriage to be with that person. And some ain't going to just ain't going to ain't going to leave the marriage because they can just go and do what they want to do. Hell yeah. They're going to stick with their way. They're going to stick beside them. You know what I'm saying? Or she's going to stick beside them. You know what I'm saying? So, but the fucked up part is the innocent bystander who don't know what the fuck going on. Okay. And don't know shit. Okay. And I feel like somebody's saying they're in open marriage, but their wife or husband don't know they're dealing with the same fucking sex. I'm getting more of a man. They're dealing with the same sex, and the wife think they're dealing with a woman, but they're really not. Okay? Damn, I'm getting a lot with this marriage shit. What y'all doing? And then, not, okay, and another thing I was about to say, like that innocent person, they find out you're in a marriage, you're going to make them not never want to get married because you done goddamn scarred them with that bullshit. They gonna, you know what I'm saying? You gonna think they gonna be like, damn, this is what marriage is, because that's what you led them to believe after you lied and deceived them like that. Okay? I, don't, I feel like somebody gonna find out, like they gonna go through his phone, they gonna, they gonna slip up in some type of way, and this person gonna find out, or they gonna catch them with their family, and then, and this, and it's like, it's crazy because like it's an open marriage, but this girl, girl don't know shit about this shit. So now this person gonna think. That, oh, they they a home wrecker because they was messing with a married man, even though that married man lied. But not only did he lie, she don't even know this shit is open. So you shouldn't feel bad at all. They should feel bad. They deceived you. Okay? 
I don't know what the fuck going on. <laughs> this is crazy. This is crazy. So that's what I got. You feel what I'm saying? It's crazy as hell. It's crazy as hell. I don't understand what's going on with these marriages and what the fuck they're supposed to call themselves being, but I guess this is what it is. It's playing games. Okay? But it's open. What's the whole... Uh, uh, don't get me started. Y'all be like, what's the whole point? Y'all might as well just be single. But hey, if it works for them, I guess it works, right? But don't put innocent bystanders in the game with y'all bullshit, okay? Especially if this person didn't tell this person about that shit. That shit's so fucked up. Okay, okay, next on to the next, okay? It's fun, I'm not dealing with fidelity, and then here I'm coming with the, okay, you got somebody that is really admiring you behind the scenes. They are just playing in the background. They're your quiet supporter. They like, you know what I'm saying, rooting you on, you know what I'm saying, proud of you behind the scenes. You really don't know this person feel this way or got this way going on. This, this person really, you know, really fucks with you they really like you but they i don't know it's giving me somebody either in the situation ship or they done fucked up already so all they can do is stay in the background some of this some of these people somebody person this is somebody you ain't never met before but they felt like they knew you all their life like this is somebody you ain't never met before okay some is somebody who fucked up some of y'all you got somebody who fucked up okay and they can just watch you by the far and I feel like making it up to you, they support you, okay? If it's behind a fake profile or not, but they still support you, they really fuck with you still, okay? All right, okay. Then you got, um, somebody got a crush on you. I feel like somebody in a position, in a certain position, so they can't pursue you or come after you or flirt with you because the role they play in their position. But low key, they kind of feeling you like hell. Like they be watching you. you feel me? You give me somebody like got cameras. You know they can watch the whole job with cameras. They be watching your ass, okay? Out the window when you pull up, they know what time you about to come in. They watch you pull up. They watch you walk in. They watch you on the camera sometimes. They, you know what I'm saying? They come around, but you think they ain't paying you no attention. They, they paying you some attention. They watching you, okay? But I feel like the position they play in whatever position you in, it's like two opposites to get to me. It's like one. It's way on the power and yours is more like, you know what I'm saying? I feel like no job title is bigger than the others, but yours is more, you know, I don't know, guess employee. It's giving me like boss employee type shit. So, of course, they can't do that. They got to play their role. You feel what I'm saying? So, I also got that, guys, okay? So, you probably got somebody in the workplace, somebody, you know, somebody who runs something. They're supposed to be thinking that way or... You know, liking you in that type of way or interesting you in that type of way because this, you know, the element in the set segment. I mean, element in the community y'all around. You feel what I'm saying? Plus, it's the role this person play in the position that they don't supposed to be doing shit like that. So they feel some type of way, but they crush a lot of the two. Okay, but I be feeling like they watch it behind the scenes. I feel like they got ways to get records and no shit, even though where you stay at. Tell you the truth, I feel me, that's how much position they is. That's how much information they got on all their peoples. You know what I'm saying? Not like that, but they give you like they they looking you up extra. Okay, extra. Okay, that's kind of like want to get to know you. Okay, a lot of y'all y'all fit the people type. I mean, you don't fit the people aspect. It's like. People look at you and they assume one thing, but it's not what they think it is. And you kind of just like fuck them up a little bit because they, you don't, they don't get what they see. I feel what I'm saying? It's like, I don't know, it's giving me like somebody who always got the rest in bitch face all the time. But really in reality, that's a real sweet person. They just, they can't help their face look like that when they ain't smiling. You feel what I'm saying? It's like, it's giving me that. All right? You give, make me feel like you make people timid. It's people timid. T like Tim, like you make them like intimidated. Okay, they kind of like I don't know, don't know how to come up to you. But then when they find out who you are, they kind of be cool. But they don't want to be like too much on you because it's like I don't know, I don't know what it is. I don't know how you, I don't know if your vibe changes, your energy changes, or what it is. But but I don't know. It just give me like I don't, I don't know what to say, y'all. It's just. 
they don't <laughs> it's like people just ju- misjudge you real quickly without even knowing you okay they've got their own perception of you in their mind and they be already like projecting until they get to know you some people get jealous of you before they get to know you and it ain't shit to be jealous of but they know in the back of their mind you the type somebody they crushing on around y'all might like or if they man be a friend of you or they woman be around you they'll be looking at you the type they probably will go for you know or maybe i don't know it's some reason you make somebody feel insecure but you're really a cool ass down to earth person and you ain't even thinking in them in them ways it's like i don't know you reflecting the like you reflect the people's fears inside them without even fucking knowing you do it. But then once you get, like, they get to know you, it's like a different damn story, okay? And they end up, you know, feeling crazy. If, you know, you get them a, you know, you get them another, another perspective, but yet you still keep to your damn self. You get what I'm saying? Like, you get them a little bit, not too much, but you don't get them nothing to sweat about and worry about, okay? But you still leave that mystery with you, too. You get what I'm saying? All right, y'all. All All right, okay. That's all I got right now, okay. I'm in the water. So I kind of want to, like, cleanse off now since I did the run. I was like, shit. But watch y'all thoughts. Treat us like you want to be treated. I had to think about that. Okay, and don't be so judgmental. Thank you for vibing with your girl. I appreciate y'all. Love y'all. Bye. I hope this helps. Love you.